today I'm going to show you how to edit photos using PowerPoint. So we just use select blank and we're gonna select photos since I want to make some birthday photos. So I use birthday themes. I search on Google. photo background so we just select the nice one I'm scrolling and choosing is quite nice but they have this logo there they have this watermark for the, the one the owner of the photo so I'm not gonna use it this one also have that watermark there so definitely no This one, let me try this one. Okay, so we're just gonna copy it and go back to our PowerPoint, paste, position, drag, resize, resize to fit. They have also that watermark down there, but we can grab that one. Okay, and that's it. And we're gonna check. We're gonna insert another photo just select photos for example mine I'll try this one and this one too big try to format and you can crap it but it's too big I can see the edges I need to drag to find where's the edge you can just start cropping really huge photo there's the edge resize Take the corner, resize, drag, and now the edge is gone again. So I don't want it, so I just cut it. And I'm gonna choose another photo. Let me see if this one works.
oh if you open the photo on the photo folder photo view where you can make copy so you just go to the folder and copy there straight no need to open it in the photo viewer it's too big again so I just steal someone's photo on Facebook so see she's the birthday celebrant of September Mila Calpito so I'll just choose a photo on her Facebook This one is a bit dark. Okay, try this one. So we can just grab, drag. Photo tools, grab. at the top is too wide so we can cut it side by side grab drag the photo where you want to put it the space is quite big there we go and you exit from crap and now it's the we make the edge soft so as you see edge of the photo becomes soft just like it's fading the, 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 the edges and there we go and if you want to put some uh, text message you can insert text box it's up to you where you want to put it there you type the word I'm writing here sis Mila it's her name and you choose the font resize you choose the font so we choose this one You can resize, become bold. We use, I use bold to make it big. And you choose the what's going on. I'm lost. Size and abs it's up to you where you want to put it. You can put it anywhere you want. 
can put it there or there or somewhere here and you can resize the 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 the, the, the thing there you can uh, drag the text box you can position it and since that one is not so clear you can select all the text select fill see i'm selecting color it's a bit more you can see from the background so i just use yellow even though it's not really showing anyway it's just an example so we're done now you're going to save this is just a simple now you're going to save save as powerpoint presentation you select folder where you want to keep it my files my documents like that the things that i used to do i used to keep it in folder d select type since you want to save it as a photo you select the jpeg format jpeg format it's the photo format and if you have two or more than slide you can select every slide but since i have only one slide i'll just use current slide then it will be automatically saved and now we're going to find the the photo that we saved oh dear i can't find maybe i'll put on another folder it's gone missing uh oh it's missing we're gone oh dear okay we're going to save to another place we find another folder save us powerpoint presentation i'll just save it in d drive birthday august i just put it inside there since it's the birthday celebrant and i'll change the name mila the file name so it's easier for me to see then change the format into jpeg save current slide then here we go we can check it in the folder drive d birthday celebrant mila there it goes it will you can open the file in the photo photo viewer so it's photo already your powerpoint transform into photo it's how you trans uh, save your powerpoint presentation into photo what do you call this photo format so you can just share it from photo viewer you can share it directly to your social media and we try to post this on facebook if you want to post it on facebook exit from here go to my home photo photo or video then you select mila select open then it's there already it's loading but i'm not gonna post this now because i already post another photo earlier 
I'm just showing an example that it's showing already it's a photo.